As we all know by now, Novak Djokovic won the Australian Open with an injured hamstring, but the extent of the injury hasn't actually come out until now, with Craig Tyler, the Australian Open director, coming out and talking about how bad the injury actually was for Novak Djokovic during the Australian Open. Let's go over read what he had to say. This is what Craig Tyler had to say on radio this morning. A lot of challenges around Novak is that he gets a bad rap. But at the end of the day, I don't think anyone can question his athleticism. This guy I did see, he had a three centimeter tear in his hammy. Absolutely, I saw the scans. The doctors are going to tell you the truth. There was a lot of speculation about whether it was true or not. It's hard to believe that they can do what they do with those kind of injuries. He's remarkable to deal with it extremely professionally. So there it is. That's what Djokovic had to deal with, a three centimeter tear in his hamstring for the entire tournament. Now, we did see strapping on his leg for the start of the tournament. He did look a little slow, but then, of course, he beat Diminor, he beat Paul, and he beat Rublev seemingly okay, but it's all the treatment that he went through through in the day and through the days off that he didn't play tennis because, remember, he played one day on, one day off through in the slams and, of course, won the trophy at the end, but that goes to show that he can do things that normal people can't do. He can play with injuries that normal people can't play with as does Nadal, to be fair. Nadal also plays with injuries. Remember, he had a tear, uh, I think, in his abdomen a couple of, uh, about a year ago, and he played with that for a long time, too. So these guys play with ridiculous injuries and still make everyone look silly. But let me know down in the comments below. Does this clarify or does this convince you that Djokovic was injured? Because I know a lot of people are saying that he was faking the injury. Uh, I think that obviously shows that he's not a three centimeter tear. And coming from Craig Tiley, not someone associated with the Djokovic camp whatsoever. He's associated with the Australian Open, saying that he was definitely injured throughout the Open, and it just makes Djokovic's feat of winning 22 slams and his 10th Grand Slam at the Australian Open even bigger after that injury.